Well, we got a small emergency job we got to do for Farmer Chris this morning, and I got me some new help. Where'd he go? Here. You ready to go work? Hey, what you got in your backpack? Is that all your tools? No. What's in there? My snacks. Your snacks? Yeah. Who packed that for you? My mom. Your mom? Yeah. You know what rule number one of the job site is? You don't tell anybody your mom did anything for you because I'll make fun of you. And today's your birthday. Today is my birthday. I'm 41 today. I'm getting old, Gunner. So, all right. And Farmer Chris, Farmer Chris is making me work on my birthday. What kind of friend is that? <laughs> me friend all right you want to put that on the trailer we gotta get that uh somewhere where it don't fall off we gotta get this yeah let's slide it right back in here tug it right away right there we're not going very far and we'll go fast all right, not 100% for sure what we're getting into this morning, but I think we got everything we need. We actually got the uh, two-foot bucket snuck in down there. Got a the tile car on the back. Chris said he's got a tile. He's got a tractor. He's got everything else he needs. So let's get this filthy rig fired up and uh, hit the road this morning. Did you get it warmed up? Like you brought your mud boots, you brought your tennis shoes. All right, all right, we got about a 20 minute little trip to where we're going. Get out loaded and get this party started. You still awake over there? Somebody may have took a nap on the way to work this morning. see where we need to unload. I think we're working in that field over there where the big roll of pipes at. What do you think? Does that load on the road over here? Well, where are we on park? That's what it is park on the road. Or you could park like right here. I don't know if I can get over. You just want me to get hung up some more, don't you? I think we can leave him enough room if we go right here. Please don't ride out of the mailbox. Alright, let's go get unloaded. Going down! Look at 
आवाज Who's that? It's got a little battery. Twelve percent. You ready to get this thing unloaded? Mm -hmm. Why don't you guys stand over here so I can see you, so I can get it off the trailer, and then we'll get the uh, get the rest of it. You stay right here. Okay. Chris isn't here yet today. Does that mean you're in charge? Where are we going? <laughs> that way? All right, I think we need to go over here and we need to find the old pipe. You know where the old pipe's at? Let's go see if we can find it. Well, one of you guys grab the tripod, the other one grab the laser. I'll grab the tripod. You guys got it? Yeah. All right, we're off. Let's see what we can find. Why do we need the laser? Because yeah. the laser is what helps us keep it on grade so we make sure it drains right. Okay. Should be a pipe down in here somewhere. You gotta dig down over here? Yeah, dig down and find the pipe or go somewhere close to the pipe. It's gotta be somewhere like that. That little pipe is probably. Yeah, let's set it down right here and we'll go look for the pipe. Ooh. Easy. Well, Gunner, we found the pipe. You were nowhere close, bud. You were looking. Down there. He's down there looking on the bridge. We well, ain't gonna be on the bridge. You told me to look on the bridge. No. You didn't know where it was at, Howard? You didn't either? <laughs> All right, so it is draining some water, but as you guys see on the other end, the dam's still somewhat full. What are you, uh, 
I don't know if we, that tree right there ain't much. That's just a junk tree, yeah. I don't know if we would be better off just coming straight through here. Like I said, yeah, you get down here like where this junk sycamore is, you're going to get pretty deep down here compared to where you're sitting on these rocks up here. Yeah. You're going to gain some depth pretty quick. All right. That big tree is just a hackberry up there. It ain't much. You got to take it down, but you might be able to go right between it there. Yeah, I think maybe we'll come right up through here. I think that tree right there needs to be our starting point or our guide. So, all right, we'll get the excavator. Let's get us a get us a starting point, and we'll get the laser set up, and then we'll go. Let me get the trees taken out first, and then you can run. All right, before we get digging here, I'm gonna help Chris get this tile cart hooked up. This thing is extremely nose heavy. We borrowed this from the company we get all of our tile from. I really need to buy one. This thing works, but let me tell you, it is well used. I'm gonna take the uh, take the excavator here and kind of raise it up so I can get the uh, get it hooked up to the get it hooked up to the tractor here. So. I don't know if I explained this real well, but right there there's a small dry dam that catches water that comes out of the woods right there. Pretty good little spring up there. And there's a four inch tile that runs down here to the woods, which is what we were looking at before. And the tile has got to be partially damaged. It's taking some water, but it's not taking enough water. It's hard to tell with the uh, grass growing up right now, but it still lays really wet right down through here. And uh, hard for them to get in here to get planted. So basically we're going to replace it with a brand new six inch tile, which should add some capacity and some rigidity. Right here where we're starting off at the creek. Uh, where did I say I was going to start? I just forgot. Start off at the creek. The, uh, there's a rock bottom down there, so that's kind of going to set our grade on how deep we can be up there because we want to get that pipe lowered down a little bit because some water leaks out underneath the dam so we're going to clear out a handful of little trees right here get us a working path going down to the down to the water and uh, basically get our get the sun down through here oh that thing didn't want to come out of there now did it once we kind of figure out how deep we can be we'll uh, set our laser up get running up through there. Put them on the edge of the woods for now. Probably tuck them along here a little bit later. All right, guys, a little path down in here. Let's, uh, <coughs> excuse me, dig down and see what we got. All right, Gunner's in learn mode though. You know what this thing does? This is gonna be your first job as the grade rod man. <laughs> See how it beeps? It makes an annoying sound. That means I did my job right. So first thing we gotta do is go figure out our slope. So we're gonna set this on the ground right here. And we're gonna walk up to the other end. They got work? All right, let's go run some pipe. We're like 2.4%, and as you guys can see, we got a wet spot up here. So let's time to get some pipe in the ground. Let's do it. We got a birthday party this evening. Yeah, we got a birthday party. We can't be missing out on that. Who's birth Who's sister. It's your sister's birthday. Nobody else's? Who else's birthday is it? How old's your sister? How old is she? One? One. How old am I? It's got a one in it. I'll give you a hint. Say 41. <laughs> Farmer Chris is trying to talk him into giving me 41 spankings, but he's got to catch me first. <laughs> All right, 
we got the pipe laid out. We got our laser set up. Chris is down there doing the final adjustments with his foot. Some gravelly stuff in the a lot of water in it surprisingly though. That's what Howard said. He should have brought his green dozer. It'd be a lot easier. It's also more expensive.
and shovel some dirt on it right here. No, right here. Right there. Yeah. Shoveled. Push it in. Push. He's trying to take my job. You'll let him have it, won't you? Get some dirt on it. Okay. Where's your buckets? Got it. All right, it's not too crucial right here. We're, we got a little bit of gravel, but as we get up a little bit farther, we get into some of that chunky clay stuff. Just kind of bring a little bit of dirt in on top of it. Make sure that pipe's good protected. I bring the rest in. Chris will let this sit through a rain or two to help disc it out. It should be good to go. We're going for rain this afternoon, so I don't think he's going to have to wait real long. What are you doing? I did? Yeah. Alright, climb up here. You know whenever you're sitting in front of me, you make it hard to see, right? Yeah. I know you want to drive this thing, but this is not the place to do because we can't be tearing up Chris's field. You need to wait till we're out in the middle of a wide open field and we have nothing we can tear up. And right here we can tear up a whole bunch of stuff that we'll have to fix it. I promise I'll let you skip some dirt at some point. Yeah, with the laser still in the lane. All right, move us on. Stop right there. I got that backfield pretty much as far as we can go. I'm going to uh, switch buckets back out. I guess we'll dig through that dam, see if we can get her drained. Hopefully we don't make too big a mess. Gotta love quick couplers.
get hung up in there. Yeah.
that's the skinny bucket. Oh, it's over there. Yeah, it's over there. Well, I got in here. There's no promises I'm going to get back out. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Think I'll make it out? Is the semi? I don't think that's gonna do much pulling there, is it? Not out here. You just don't want to jump down there and hold that, Chris? <laughs> I ain't got the right boots on. Oh, the right boots. That's the. They're area, but not the, not as good as yours. I got the shallow water boots okay. on. Mine, mine's a bit high. That pipe ain't floating too bad back there, is it? Is it floating? that riser in there before we put a bunch of water down it i don't know if you guys can see it i got the water dammed off over here before we put that water down the riser i'm gonna go cover up the rest of that pipe that way we ain't gotta worry about it floating up if it floats up it, uh, it'll lose our grade so i think i can cross right here famous last words Oh yeah, get that tractor out of our way and we'll be in good shape. with right here we're trying to gently get this dam packed it back in there without smashing that pipe this stuff uh it's good play it'll seal up good but it's so wet and it's so sticky it's hard to get it to kind of smash out and bond the way you want it to but it is just a dry dam so Take the teeth, make a few uh, grooves in it, give that next layer of stuff to kind of bond to. Take it, take it. All right, climbed up here on the other side, trying to take some of this sludge, just kind of get it set up here in the woods. Our dam. It's about to give out over there. She's about full. We're about ready to find out if this pipe's going to take water or not. The good news is, I think we're ready for it to take water. Here 
Ranger. There comes the water. It's probably two and a half, three feet lower than it was. Well, hair going down. Well, we finally got it, guys. That was a little bit of a booger, but uh, it don't look the best. It don't have to look the best. It just has to work, and it is working really well, and the field's already starting to dry up out there. So all in all, we'll call that a muddy, messy success. Think there's any water coming out of it? Mm -hmm. Let's go look. There's not any water coming out of it. That means we're gonna have to go redo our job. Oh, look at that, I see water, don't you? Yeah. There it is. It's running good. That means we can go to a birthday party now. Hey, did you have fun today? Mm -hmm. Did you learn anything? Mm -hmm. What's that? You learned how to be a good pack mule, didn't you? Packed everything over. I was cleaning this up. He packed everything back over the trailer for me. Got ready to load up so we can get out of here. I five. So, well, all right. We have to go off on a hill. Yeah, we gotta go do one other small job for Chris. We're not gonna video that one. So tell him bye. Bye. Hope you guys liked the video. If you did, give her a big old thumbs up. I'm sure. I'm sure you guys are gonna see more Gunner in the future on the videos. He's getting to the age where he wants to come out here and be part of it. So, if you want to see more of that, I consider subscribing. No way we catch you guys on the next one. Later.